This is just the living area slash kitchenette. It's very nice. And the table with the really weird sort of, I don't know, it's kind of like a fruit bowl, I think. Ooh. That's the view from our hotel room. The water is very clear. And, oh wow, door's a bit sticky. It's very windy out here. <laughs> Look, the chairs have blown over. That's crazy. So let's have a look and explore the apartment. It's very, very big. It's like a little laundry in here. It's very poorly lit. Ha, second bedroom. <laughs> we got upgraded. Oh, there's a, another TV. There are TVs everywhere in here. And there's a bathroom down there, but it's really poorly lit, so I'm not gonna go in there. This is our kitchen. Very exciting. And walk-in wardrobe. And mirror. Ooh, ooh. Double sinks, there's shower, TV, and our bedroom mess. The apartment tour has now come to a close. So I'm planning on going to the big shopping center and going to Sephora today. So I'm just gonna quickly put on some makeup. Floral, comfy shoes, they're vans. I like them a lot. And I know I'm gonna be doing a lot of walking around the shops today, so yes, time to support. Mm. Well, though, I was sticking to a bit of a budget. Um, I got some stuff from Lush, I got some stuff from Mecca, and of course I went to Sephora because I really just wanted to check out the Surfers Paradise Pacific Fair store. I don't know if it's in Surfers Paradise. So from Lush, I grabbed another Lord of Misrule bath bomb. Noise pollution. Noise pollution. Somebody's trying to wash dishes. The other one I got, just for something different, is a new one. And this one is the Northern Lights bath bomb. There we go. It's really cool. It's pretty. It's like a telescopy sort of thing. And it's purple on the outside, blue on one end, and orange yellow on the other end. And it's supposed to be like a really calming, soothing purple bath. And at Mecca, I grabbed a couple of 
couple of things, not very much. There were only a couple of things that I wanted there. Uh, the Pacific Fair store is the only one that carries the Chosunga 20 um, 22, I think it's version 22, range of makeup. They have all of the new Mecca K Beauty products. But yeah, so that's the packaging. And inside, it's like a metal tin. And it's really great because all of the names of these shadows are like space related. And here are our shades. And they're really pretty. <gasps> So I'm not going to show you that eyeshadow palette anymore because one of the shades fell out onto me and I'm going to have to take it back to Mecca and exchange it. Um, anyway, the other thing that I got from Mecca was this really cute Winky Lux Lip Balloon and it's got like this really tiny kind of gold and silver bullet with a little pattern on the silver side and Winky Lux on it. It's just a classic nudie mo shade and it's called Meow. <laughs> Which is kind of the reason I bought it, but yeah. From Sephora, here's my bag. I don't like the package design for their bags, for the big ones. They're really annoying. It's literally just like a paper bag style thing. And they just, they just, there's no handle. It was really hard to carry around the shops for the rest of the time that I was there. Get bags with handles, guys. So, from Sephora, I got some little buffing rectangles for my nails. I bought this really cute little Sephora brand eyeshadow palette. It's part of their little Christmas collection. And I got this one for my mom. It's got nine eyeshadows. It's quite a pretty package. I, I would open it, but because it is for my mom, I'm not going to touch them. I got the Beauty Blender Pro On The Go. So it's their little pro kit with couple of beauty blenders, the black one, pro one, and the original little pro mini beauty blender, Blood RC Pro, and a solid beauty blender cleanser, which I'm interested to try because I've actually never used the original beauty blender proper cleansing product, so yeah, I'm keen, keen to try the one. I got the Tarte Amazonian 12 hour clay foundation. I got it in medium neutral. Yes, that's what it looks like. It's oil free. Yeah, it's supposed to be quite high coverage. We've got this cute little Bumble and Bumble mini BB thickening dry spun finishing spray for the hair. Just a little one to create like fullness and texture. And I got the Mario Badescu. Is it Badescu? Um, I got their facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. And this one I grabbed, it's supposed to be like a rejuvenating facial spray. Really good for hot days when you just want something to spritz you up and make you feel a little more cool and refreshed. But yeah, um, I sprayed it and I smelled it and I thought it smelled so good, just like rose water. And I really love the smell of rose water. So yeah, this one's gonna be fun for me. And last but not least, I got a couple of things from Marc Jacobs. I bought a lipstick and I got this free Marc Jacobs little mascara mini and it's their noir. It's got an interesting little brush there. It looks like it might be quite good for volume. Not so much lengthening, but I like volume. I also got the Marc Jacobs Le Marc Lip Cream and this is in the shade Mahogany, which I cannot open this box apparently. <sighs> How pretty is that? And it's a really nice sort of mahogany sort of brown, taupey color. So on that note, I'm off to Mecca to try and get a replacement for my eyeshadow palette. Um, hopefully we'll see you next week in our video, and yeah, stay excellent. Bye!